Hi everyone, this is Crafty Decoria and I hope everyone is doing great. I hope you had a wonderful weekend and I just want to say that hopefully I will be able to get some DIYs done. I had so many in the works for spring and it ended up that my brother suffered a heart attack and so I was in the hospital with him and but now thank God he is on the mend and hopefully I can get back to making some DIYs. But I did stop by a Dollar Tree and I didn't pick up very many items but everything that I did pick up was new to me and because it was a little bit of a smaller haul I decided to just take some pictures from the inside of the Dollar Tree I was at so that you could see some of the other things that they had in there. Some were things that I've already seen and others were things that I just really didn't have a use for them. But I thought I'd share that with you just the same. So as usual in front of me, here is an overview of the things that I did pick up. I will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look. I hope you enjoy. To begin the haul, I picked up LA's Totally Awesome Bleach. It is in the fresh scent. Now I've already purchased a couple products from the LA's Totally Awesome line. I picked up the cleaner that comes in the clear bottle with the red writing and that worked amazing. And then I tried the laundry detergent which worked really nice as well. I was really happy with that. So now when I seen it in the bleach, I figured I'm, you know, I would pick it up and give it a try. There is 96 ounces, 2.84 liters, so that was a really good size, and if this works as well as the other two products, I definitely will be repurchasing this again. Over in the kitchen department, these are a couple of new items that I had not seen before. Of course, I love the glass containers for storage that the Dollar Tree carries. This time around, I picked up these that are like a mason jar. They have a gold lid. And then it's just white on the inside. And what I love about these is that it has the measurements on the sides of the jar. So on this side, it has uh, mills. So there's 250 here, 500 here, and then the in-between marks. And then on the other side, it has cups and ounces. So one cup, two cup, and then um, the ounces as well. So it came in the larger size as well as a smaller size. And it has the same measurements on this as well. So one cup, two cup, ounces, and then mils. 100 mil, 200 mil, 300 mil. So I love how these look, but they're also great because you can use them for measuring as well. And then I came across these skimmers, and these are from Cooking Concepts. They are really nice looking. They have the nickel finish at the top with the black, and then it has like the chicken wire for the ladle part. So these are called skimmers. And they only had a few of these left, so I was really happy to come across these. So this was a really fun find. For one, it's one of our favorite games, the Popper Junior game, and it's in the Finding Dory theme. And this is a really great item to pick up we do have the larger size, but this is great for keeping it in the travel trailer or if you're traveling anywhere, really even in your car because it is a smaller size. And this is what it looks like on the back. I was so excited that they had these there. I have seen these at Dollarama and I was trying to look the same day that I had gone to the Dollar Tree. I passed by the Dollarama to see how much these were. Um, I don't believe they're as low as $1.25, but I don't think they were as much as $4. They might have been $2.50, $3 maybe, I'm thinking around there. If any of you know, let me know in the comments below. 
um, but I do think it's a great deal for $1.25. It's a great way to keep um, little ones entertained or even adults. I enjoy playing it as well. Over in the clothing area, I just picked up some basic t-shirts and I love getting these because for $1.25 that is a great deal and you can get them in so many different colors. So I just picked up a plain white t-shirt and these are by All Style Apparel, Apparel and Active Wear. And then I also picked up a light pink one because pink is so pretty in the spring and this is by All Style as well. And then I picked up a couple scarves and this was the only one that I saw in the pink cheetah print and I thought this would look really nice against the white and it would also look nice against the pink. And I picked up a plain white one as well. And then their bandanas. I love these bandanas. Usually I get them in the red and blue, but I saw these ones here in these really, really pretty spring colors and I just had to pick them up. So you get two bandanas for $1.25 here in Canada. So it had this really nice blue and then the fuchsia pink. And then this one here was like the lighter pink and then like a minty, a light minty green. So I'm really happy to have come across these. So to finish off the haul, the next items are all decor pieces and I was super excited to come across them and bring them home with me. Probably my most favorite out of all that I brought home are these here. These are quite heavy and they are one and a half feet long and then an inch wide. They came in black and white and there were three different sayings that I saw and these are them here. The first, make your dreams happen. Your attitude determines your direction. And my most favorite, home is where the family gathers. And I just like the combination of font styles they use to make these. These were probably my most favorite find of the day. So these were an item that I seen hauled in the US and was really hoping that they would arrive here in Canada and they did. I was so happy to come across them. These are beautiful decor pieces, whether you leave them empty or fill them up with something. I think they are so pretty and I just love the colored glass. My favorite of the three is this lighter blue and it has the ship's wheel attached to it. I love how they added the jute twine as well as these little wood pieces. Oh, and I didn't realize that one of the things here were broken. So I might just glue the jute twine right there. So pretty. And then the clear one with the anchor. And then the darker blue with the starfish. I absolutely love these. And if you have a beachy type of theme, I'm sure you will too. These next decor pieces are also really, really nice. I love the backdrop on these because they have these succulents either in pots or you just see the fronts of the succulents. So these look like they are faux wood, but they are the, um, the MDF. I don't know if it says it on here, but like that press board MDF. But as you can see on the front and back, it looks like a faux wood, which is really nice. And then they have the galvanized steel here, metal on the front, little strip of it. And then each of them say something different. So I found four different sayings. The first here, good vibes only. And they're nice because they stand up on their own. Plant a garden and watch it grow. Life is my favorite adventure. 
And then my favorite, thankful and grateful. And the last decor pieces to show you are very similar to the previous ones that I showed you. Now these, as well as those, are by Green Briar International Incorporated. Again, you can see on the back, it's like the press board, but on the front here, it does give a faux wood look. These at the bottom, where the block is, they all have some glitter on there, so if you're not fond of glitter, these might not be your favorite, but you could just um, use some hairspray to um, keep those in place. This one here is my absolute favorite. It says, home is where the family gathers. Again, um, just a little stand, so they do stand up on their own. This one in purple says, it's the little things in life. Really nice. This one I really love as well. Our nest is best. And then the last one with these unicorns at the top says wild and free. So really, really nice, fun finds. It wasn't a huge haul, but it was a very enjoyable haul. I enjoyed everything that I brought home and I really hope that you enjoyed the haul as well. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, share the video if you can, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would really love it if you did. As always guys, you take care of yourselves and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye bye.